Hello. Welcome to our project to rebuild the Pompeian Court, a life-size model of a Pompeian house that was built by the Victorians in South London in the Sydney Crystal Palace that opened in 1854. The house was built so that Londoners could explore the layout of a typical Pompeian house, just like those that were destroyed when Vesuvius erupted over the Roman town of Pompeii in 79 AD. It was part of the gigantic Crystal Palace Museum, an ambitious educational and social experiment in which all the exhibits were fakes, models and reconstructions designed to bring the past to life as a way of educating and entertaining ordinary Londoners. Our project is all about exploring this wonderful building which burnt down in 1936 and the ways it was used and imagined. In particular, we're very interested in how the Victorians' use of reconstructions relate to our own use of virtual technology. There are three elements to our visualisation. First is the model itself. We used all the guidebook plans, archive photographs and press illustrations we could find to visualise the court and its contents, especially the paintings with which it was originally decorated. The second is the way that the model acts as an archive for the scattered material that documents the court. Extracts of the guidebook and press reviews can be accessed in different ways around the court, including the virtual guide. The third element of the project is our cast of robot characters, or bots, which populate the model, play out original reactions to the court and interact with visitors. The first phase of the project was funded by JISC and enabled us to build the model and archive in Second Life, an online virtual world. The second phase of the project, funded by the University of Bristol's Impact Development Fund, helped us to migrate the model to OpenSim, an open source virtual world platform, and to develop other bot characters so that we could make the model useful and accessible to a wider audience, particularly school students. We developed an extensive course of learning activities in conjunction with the Year 9s of Chantry High School in Ipswich. Key to their learning was the different levels of the past they could inhabit in our virtual world. Students can experience the house as a Victorian exhibit, as a Pompeian house, as well as a disaster site. Our project is always evolving and growing as we use the model to explore the Crystal Palace but also to compare Victorian and contemporary ways of modelling. In the next phase of our project, we hope to develop the sophistication of our robot avatars. On the pages of this website, you can find more information about our project, track the progress of our work and find out how to visit us in OpenSim. You can also leave a message for us here on the site, or I am Lucien Cranfell or Gwendolyn Benningborough in World. We look forward to hearing from you.